All right, in our last video, we talked about calories. We calculated how many calories you need to accomplish your goal. This video, what should those calories be made up of? How much protein, how much carbs, and how much fats? We're gonna get into all of that when we come back. All right, Live Leaners, welcome to Live Lean TV. I'm your host, Brad Guthrow. On this episode, we're talking about macronutrients. In the previous video I did a couple days ago, we talked about calories. So if you haven't watched that yet, you have to watch that video first. So go here, click that annotation, and it's gonna take you to that video to tell you how to calculate your calorie requirement for your goal. So first, go there, do that, and then come back to this video, and I'm now gonna tell you what those calories should be made up of, how much protein, how much carbohydrates, and how much fats make up your total calorie goal. If your calorie goal is 2,000 calories, you can't just eat 2,000 calories of sugar and expect to have that lean and sexy body because your hormones will be all over the place, and your hormones have such a huge role in creating a fat-burning or a muscle-building kind of body for you. So honestly, we have to figure out macros. First, figure out your calories, then go to macros, and you're gonna be well on your way with your diet. So here's how we're gonna do this. First of all, I'm gonna show you an example of somebody with a calorie requirement of 2,000 calories. Here's how some people could break it down. This may work for you, this may not work for you. This is what I would actually recommend for someone who isn't sensitive to carbs. When I say isn't sensitive to carb, I mean isn't sensitive to the insulin spikes in the blood sugar and your body can actually use the sugar. So this is what you would, I would have you do. So when you're on a 2,000 calorie diet, I would have you 40% of your calories coming from protein, 40% of your calories coming from carbohydrates, and 20% of your calories coming from fats. How this all works out. If your calorie requirement is 2,000, whatever your calorie requirement is, write it up top. Multiply that number by 40%. That's gonna give you how many calories come from protein. So 40% of your calories of 2,000 calories is gonna give you 800 calories from protein. We're gonna do the same thing for carbs. 40% of your calories are coming from carbs. That's gonna give you a total number of 800 calories from carbs, and 20% of your calories are coming from fats. That's gonna give you a total of 400 calories from fats. We're then gonna take it another step. Then we're gonna figure out how many grams of each we need. So there's four calories in one gram of protein, there's four calories in one gram of carbohydrate, and there's nine calories in one gram of fat. So we're gonna take the 800 calorie number from protein, divide it by four, and that's gonna give us 200 grams. So if our calorie requirement is 2,000, we wanna get 200 grams of protein per day, we wanna get 200 grams of carbs per day, because once again, that's 800 divided by four calories per gram. And then finally, for fats, we wanna get 44 grams of fats, that's simply 400 calories from our fat calculation, divided by nine calories per gram. This is for you if you do not have sensitivities to insulin and sugar and your body can store it and use it effectively. My body, my body not so much so. So I'm gonna recommend another plan. I'm gonna show you my macronutrient ratios that I use because I'm more sensitive to sugar. And if you're the same way, you may wanna follow my plan as well. Okay, so here is the macros that I use now. I feel like I'm missing something. All right, that feels a little bit better. Now, we're using 2,000 calories again, but we're using my macronutrient breakdown that I personally use because my sensitivity is to sugar. We have 40% still from protein. That gives us 800 calories, nothing's changed there. But we reversed the carbs and the fat. So I only have 20% of my calories coming from carbs, and that gives us 400 calories. And finally, 40% from fats, which gives us 800 calories for a total of 2,000 calories. That's broken down to 200 grams of protein, 100 grams of carbohydrates, and 89 grams of fat. I've been using this for the past six months um, because before I felt like my energy was all over the place. I had cravings all the time. I just didn't feel right. So when I added in more fats, I'm now fuller. I don't have the cravings anymore. My energy is up higher than it's ever been in my leanness. I'm living lean even more now than what I was six months ago. So it's worked out perfectly for me and I love eating fats. Um, I don't miss the sugar at all either. So it's been all good. So if you guys wanna give your diet a little bit of a switch up, if you're not liking the results you're getting or if you're having energy crashes or you're just not having the same energy that you had before, 
Try adding in more fats, very good for your hormonal system, and it will not make you fat. So many people think dietary fat just makes you fat. Not the healthy stuff, not the natural stuff. The man-made stuff, yes. Not healthy olive oil, coconut oil, meat, uh, all that kind of stuff, nuts. It's all good, add in more healthy fat into your diet. So we'll finish it off right there, guys. If you want to know more about me, you can check me out on my website, bradgothroughfitness.com. Um, loads of testimonials on there. So if you guys have testimonials from Live Lean TV, from Live Lean Afterburn, from Awaken the Eyes Within that I haven't put on my website yet, put it in the comment section below. I'd love to share your pictures, share your video testimonials, anything you guys have. Check them out on my website. And then in a few days, I'm going to come back with a new video to tell you how to distribute these calories throughout the day. So how many calories should you be having at each meal? We'll talk about that in a few days. Days. See you guys then. All right, guys, thanks for watching Live Lean TV. Please click on one of those thumbnails to the left and the right of that subscribe button to watch another Live Lean TV video. Click that subscribe button to subscribe to this channel and never miss any future episodes. And click like and share and show your support for this channel.